right, guys, we're live right now, man. Listen, we got Sneeko in the cut. We got... You'll talk to the mic, by the way. Hold on. Wait. Hold on. <laughs> Who we got here? Ara Queen Bay. And... Raquel Rose. All right, so we got someone else putting up for a actual, like, uh, live so stream, live e-date. But before that, let's do the intro and then hop into the video. So let's go. Told you can the way, let's go. Told you can, nigga. Hi, so glad it's me. Hold me around. Right, guys, we are back right now. Yo, okay, so first off, I want to say this, man. I'm glad Sneeko's here because Sneeko, what happened yesterday with that stream was terrible, bro. Can you tell me what happened with that stream, bro? So I, I went on value team and money with uh, this guy, Adam Sosnick, who's basically, I, I think he got a gas up a little bit after the PVD interview with Andrew, and now he's like, oh, I, I'm older than Sneeko. Let me big bro him for two and a half hours. He was low broing you, right? He was the whole time. And it, it wasn't, it was a really bad interview, if I'm going to be honest. I mean, I don't think that he really intended it, but it seemed like he was just trying to come off like I'm a real G, I'm all this. And then he started leaking personal information about Andrew. And I think I handled it well, but looking at some of the clips that went viral, I understand that I could have said things differently. I could have just like pretended I could have played dumb. Um, but overall, I, I wanted to call it out in the moment more. I did call him out at one point. I said that he was trying to set me up. Yeah. But yeah, it's going viral right now. And just know that. If it doesn't come out of Andrew's mouth, then you can't trust a lot of these people. Yeah. So just just it, take it as like a lot of people clout chasing. If you saw that interview, oh, just be careful about who you associate with in this red pill space because there's there's very few people. The real and the fake get exposed pretty quickly. And Fresh was um, Fresh has always been genuine with me. So yeah, I'm glad that you were in the chat right now. I, I was looking back at the live chat too. You were defending me. I saw a couple of W sneakos. Yeah. And I was looking always. back at the live chat too. I was uncomfortable the whole the whole interview comment section pretty much validated what I was thinking. They were all like, this is weird. It's yeah. going too far. I didn't even want to go there. It was too far out of the way. And usually like, I don't even do interviews for free at this point because I'm not on YouTube. It's like, I bring in a lot of viewers. So people have been, if I'm being honest, you can message at my manager, ISLXM on Instagram, Islam with the next. He coordinates most of my interviews. I did this one because he is associated with PBD and yeah. I, you know, it was a nice little studio, but I was not a fan of how, that interview was conducted. It was unnecessary. It was too much. It seems like he was trying to be like fresh and fit too. The same talking points. The fact that he brought on a girl that had nothing to do with me. Like, who yeah. is this girl? What, what, what's the point of having her here? And I hope that he, you know, I'm not trying to disrespect him, but I hope he conducts interviews better in the future because that was really poor. Yeah. And I, I came into it. I was a bro. Like, I'm here, I'm here for Sneeko. I'm going to see what's up. But, bro, when I heard the news about Andrew talking about privacy behind the scenes, I was like, bro, this is an L, bro. So I had a comment, bro, and say, not cool because, personally speaking, bro, like, you're my boy, and I didn't like it at all. So I had to talk, man. I should have I should have Frank Castle myself. I should have got the walkout. That would have been a good TikTok <laughs> clip, and that would have been more entertaining. And looking back at the live chat in the comments, I just didn't want to – I wanted to conduct myself well, and I, I think I held frame and everything like that. I think I did a good job looking you back. You did, bro. You did. You did. Thanks. And, Andrew's proud of you, bro. Yeah. Yeah, I, I was nervous about that because I was looking on TikTok. There's a one no, but, viral of him linking that. Everyone's like, so you can't trust Nico. I'm like, bro, what no, but I told Andrew that wasn't your fault, bro. So, so you're good. All right. all right, guys. But real quick, some chats here. Venom says – Quick question for Fresh. Why are numbers or special characters bad for use, use for Instagram names? So very important, guys. Instagram names want to have a brand that's going to be clear cut. No numbers, no uh, punctuation because that's your brand. You want that to be concise to the point. Like, for example, Sneeko. No numbers, no punctuation. It's just to the point. Ladies, real quick on the panel. If you can find a guy with an Instagram page with numbers, what do you think about that? You guys have underscores in your names, right? I'm probably not going to answer back. Why? If there's numbers in his name? Yeah. Is that I mean, a, is he like clearly doesn't understand branding. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> You're not kidding. That's true. No, it's, it's I mean, I, true. I respect a good like name with no numbers or like underscores. Okay, cool. By the way, um, can you tell people who you are? Because I know who you are. Sico doesn't know who you are, but who are you? What do you do? And from AL, Sico is fresh and true, homie. Yes, fresh is true. I mean, we, we roast each other stuff like that on the camera, but yeah. Yo, W wing, Wingman in the chat, bro. W <laughs> Wingman. Okay, cool. Who are you? I'm Ara. Mm -hmm. uh, my Instagram name is Ara Queen Bay. I. I'm a Persian Canadian content creator. I do 
OnlyFans, Only Instagram, TikTok, all that good stuff. So people say Persian, but is, was the Persian conquered like a while ago? Yeah, it's called Iran, yes, so you, as you know. So aren't you like if you've been living under a rock? You and also, know what did you do on uh, No Jumper? Because you said that I, I know Adam Twenty Two, and I'm curious. Is I, you look familiar? And I've seen a couple of the girls that go on. They're like, I took fifty dicks in my mouth at the scene. Line. Yeah, <laughs> that that's definitely not me. Okay, okay. Good, good, good. <laughs> we actually talked about my upbringing in Iran and how I moved to Canada and. That I used to be a chemical engineer before I quit to do social media. Full That's time. crazy, chemical engineer. Yeah. So. So what, what, what did you talk about? What was the clickbait title, or what? What was the appeal? Like you understand, like you have followers something like um, that. What was the clickbait of the episode? So I don't have to watch it. It was like Iranian Ara tells us about leaving Iran and starting an OnlyFans or something like okay. that. Okay. All right. That, so you did you leave Islam too? Um. No. I'm. I'm still. Islam. Technically Muslim, but I don't practice all of the Muslim Haram! things. But I like. Wait, you're not a practicing Muslim. No. Oh. Clearly, because yeah. my hair is showing. And you do OnlyFans. And if I was in my country and my hair was showing, it'd be a different story. I don't know if you guys know what's going on right now in Iran, but. Whole lot of gang shit. Yeah. So. Okay. And Miss Rose, what about you? Are you a practicing Muslim? <laughs> no. Okay. What do you do for work? <laughs> I thought you were gonna like, what's your religion? <laughs> I thought I was expecting the religion. <laughs> <laughs> um, I'm a hairdresser. Oh, okay. Yeah, I do hair. And I do a little bit of OnlyFans and social media. And we I also dabble, have a podcast together. There. What do you guys talk about in your podcast? I have yet to see, and I don't want to come oh, off as way. a misogynist, but... Here's our podcast, so you, can see, so you guys can see it. Female podcasts tend to be a little bit... Oof. I'm, not, I'm not gonna lie. They kind of are cringe. But <laughs> that was they, our first episode. But they seem pretty cool. So, what, what's your podcast about? It's about everything. We're gonna be touching yeah. on every subject. Female podcasts are always about taking dick. Um, it's always about how some much level. Call yeah. her daddy. Like it's just about. I feel like it's because everybody tries to go off that call her daddy blueprint, but also because we have that OnlyFans fan base, a lot of our fans are curious as to like how to pick up girls or what positions to fuck a girl in because right, guys, the majority of the advice. guys actually, to be honest, don't really know how to fuck. Right, but that is very true. So yeah. don't tell, you You don't know how to pick up a girl. I mean, a lot of guys don't like, don't know like Do basic you know? things. Like, I don't know, for example, if you bring a girl home and like your bed is messy, there's a high chance that she doesn't really want to get in there to fuck you. There's okay. simple basic things that a lot of guys don't do. That's good or else. You're adding value right now. Um, More than Adam. I don't know. Just different things like girls like good hygiene. Like make sure like you obviously shower and look fresh and like have smell good. Like when I gave you a hug, remember I, I was like, yeah. girls notice things like that. Yeah, like really when you take care of yourself. Like I dated a guy. He had. Oh, I smell. You smell pretty good. You smell pretty good? You smell like an Asian. Uh, guy I mean, right? his scent, I as soon as oh, I fuck. hugged him, I could really like. What? Smell it. Fuck. Yeah. Fuck. 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 Oh. Think five full foam. I actually like do. Are you just like being racist? It was a joke. Okay. <laughs> it was. A, was it a racist joke? Hold on. We that was good. Hold on. Hold on. Racist joke. Talking are good. about smells. Real quick. And then I was like, you smell like fuck. Real quick. <laughs> Feel this right now. <laughs> you know what that is? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> What's the material? This. Yeah. What Velvet? is it? Top G. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> I knew you, you were gonna. Can say you feel this real quick? That's my heart. Oh, that's what I'll give you. Cringe. Is it beating faster? Cringe. No, my heart beats slows when I talk to you. Oh. So <laughs> Why are you dying? I'm so I am slowly dying. <laughs> okay, you two uh, lovebirds. Real quick, um, tell them what you are, what you do, what you're about. Let's hear it. Okay, hi, I'm Raquel. I kind of said what I did already. I said I did hair. <laughs> if you didn't see that, uh, I do hair. Mm. And not only do I do hair, I also am a co-host with uh, Aura. We do a podcast. Off the air TV, uh, baby. Off the air TV. I, I do a little bit of OnlyFans. She fans. also has an OnlyFans. I wish you a page, do a but, bit you're, of everything. but you're actually private, so uh, I can't show your page. They have yeah, to follow I her. I banned because I post so much explicit content. Wait, why oh. did you lead with hairdresser if this is what you're doing? <laughs> that was very misleading, and you <laughs> know. Because that's what she does. Every single day she goes to her hair salon and she does hair. Mm -hmm. It's a true story. She used to be a full time thought, and now she's a part time thought. Yeah, exactly. Hey, whatever works, right? I took a break. Bumble Claude. Full time hairdresser. Uh, Mike says, Pico, time when are we making that movie? Yo, that sounded AO as fuck, but AO. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Best Some, you can see. Somebody's had a chemical engineer to eat that. Big thought. homie, that's, which one is yours? Baby, whatever pays which the bills. one is ours? Which one is mine? What? Dance. <laughs> that's my dick busy talking, like, which one is mine? Oh. 
Me, duh. There you go. Hello. You, you don't feel like chocolate. That's okay. I can change. There you go. I guess that's what we're finding out on this EJ. <laughs> we're gonna find out on this live EJ what's happening. Between Maybe we're doing us. like a swapping situation. How do you guys feel about that? Ooh. Ooh. Yo, would you ever would you ever share your girl? Or like if if you and your homie were on a double date. Oh, I've done enough. I've done enough. I'm kidding. 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 Would you ever get married and raise someone else's kid? Like if she already had a kid before. Yeah, yeah. Like, would you get married to? A, 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 yeah. See, you know. What I'm yeah, yeah, yeah. Feels good, huh? Feels good, right? I don't care, bro. Oh yeah. I really don't care. Yeah, I don't care either. I'm would you? Fuck. Would I'm you? Fuck. If no. the girl was married before and then, sorry, not married. If she had a kid with somebody else, would you? What do you think? I don't know. <laughs> no, Sounds like no, it's a no. no. Okay. Uh, one and she says haram. Let's get my money. Thank you, fresh and taco. Taco <laughs> Tate is crazy. That's shut the fuck up. Man. Okay, we got uh, Alex the Gamer says, sneak out contact Black Shore to get unbanned on YouTube. Can you hit up some of the the elites and do that for me? Because they don't really like me. Bro, it's, it's the L for that one. I mean, who knows? Wait, you're banned off of YouTube? YouTube, yeah. Instagram, and no, Twitch. YouTube, Twitter, t- Twitch, TikTok. What? Yeah. Yo, hit up uh, Elon Musk. Tate is back. I've been Twitter? trying to. I'm, I'm trying to get uh, hashtag free sneaker on Twitter. Tag Elon. Say free sneaker. I'm trying to get it trending. I really want to get back on. Yeah. Jordan Peterson got back on. Andrew. Guys. And Donald Trump is going to get back on Twitter too. Spread the word, yeah, I bro. I saw that. If Trump can get back, let me get back on Twitter, bro. I cannot wait to go in on these soy boys. Pause. By the way, guys, Sneakers almost at 100K. 100K on the way. Let's go. Rumble. Go support him right now. Actually, you know what? Go unsubscribe and then never go back to his page. Just kidding. Unsubscribe, guys. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Go there, subscribe. It'd be lit if you got to 100K. No, that's a big W. 100K on Rumble is a big W. I'm going to go take one of my old plaques and put Rumble on the YouTube silver plaque. Chris, let me get a fucking Rumble plaque. By the way, you got to help us too, bro. You got 100K on the way. Can we have a Rumble family channel? Ooh. Well, first we got to have a family, baby. That can happen. You got to cover your hair if we're going to have a family. Oh, shit. No, we're, we're, we're working on that. Okay. We're going to we're gonna go to the mosque and we'll talk about it. So, so Someone said, uh, Mo says, bro, Islam left her. <laughs> damn. <laughs> God damn. Bro, Islam is about to leave the whole damn country. Don't be Iran. <laughs> Cult of masculinity says, Snickos and Snick, uh, Nick are soldiers of God. Shout out to Nick Fuentes. Shout out to all the Groypers taking over. Okay. Um... We're waiting for our special guest. Wait, can I can I give you guys another tip about like guys and dating and sex? Sure, we want to hear it. We want to hear everything. Um, I really like this guy that I was dating, and he had these like special wipes for his balls to make it fresh. What? Yeah. Like like like, hold on, ball wipes? Yeah. Just baby wipes. <laughs> it was literally called ball wipes. It's just baby wipes. You're oh, capping right ju- Oh brand. wait, they have dude wipes. So was like, it from the same place? I love that. That's genius. Wait, what's going on here, bro? After ball wipes, um, I don't know about the baby soft. powder. I wait, dated a guy yeah. that used to baby powder ball his wipes. Balls, thing. So, like, do you want it? <laughs> wait, 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 hold on, hold on. This is the top so, tier content you're gonna so, hear on their podcast. So, ball wipes. When you wait. wipe your balls, like, uh, I mean, does it really matter? It makes it like fresh and soft. You like, it makes it soft? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think wipes make it soft. But like, okay, okay. So when you go down there, I'm guessing you like you like balls, right? So like, that's your thing. So like, I love balls. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. Good to know. Wait, no, I meant like fresh. No homo. Are you? I, I hate. I hate that. Me area. too. No, I don't bro, like that bro, being touched, bro. I'm gonna touch my balls. I'm good on that. I'm good. On that. See, I always ask. I always ask the guys because I know. Yo, yo, I know. I'm like. I'm like. Yo, yo, a girl, a girl will be like this. I'm like, yo, yo, stop it. Just. Go go top. This feels weird, bro. Just move. Back. Back. You like balls too? Uh, no, I like dickheads. Dickheads? Yeah, like I like them because I know that they're the most sensitive, so I like to like. But see, I feel like every guy's it. different. Some okay. guys like it, some guys don't. So I always ask. I I'm be personally, I don't like it, bro. I'm just call me gay. weird, I'm but like. You know. Yeah, I get a little advice right now. <laughs> okay. I just like dicks in general. I think they're so interesting. What's your favorite color, Dick? <laughs> <laughs> Um, I don't really. Color doesn't matter. I don't think that I. Do really... you like this with a bend in it? No. You like the straight, straightforward. You know that's like a genetic a deformity, a right? It is. You'll see. Yeah. Don't worry. But like, like having a curve in your dick is a genetic deformity. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Go, go, go fuck it though. Does this stream like yeah, hearing no, about this to, like, or hit no? the G spot supposedly. Yeah. Yo. Okay. Question though. Question though. Land for curve. <laughs> question. <laughs> Land for Honestly, curve. it's a it's a combination of both for me. Damn, I'm blessed then. Length right. or girth. Yeah, length or girth. And honestly, it's also about like how you use it. 
It's the motion, motion in the ocean. ocean? Yeah. Right, right. Is that really real? That's a real thing. Yeah, like you can't just be doing like in and out, in and out. Like, is this a sex podcast? No. It is not because you guys are making it. You can use balls. Wow. No, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, we didn't bring up balls. Yeah, that was you guys. Okay, I need to do a prayer. I'm because... the girl to change the subject. Yeah. Okay, well, your friend brought a ball. Like I was just saying about the tip, so you guys ran with it. Okay. How about this? Be nice, says. I gave you guys just the tip, and you ran with it. Uh. Not funny. Okay, D Nice says, "Great job, Sneko, holding frame with, with Adam." Thank you. Tell TikTok because everybody on TikTok is all my dick right now, and they take it out of context. Just whatever, bro. Hey, I mean, time will tell. Time. What is real with Prosper? We got uh, Astro Swole says, "Fresh, do you need a business to have business credit? If so, how can you summarize business credit in your own words, bro? This is a chill stream, <laughs> not about money. I get it. You want to know about money, but bro, no, add value. Tell them some real S- shit. Simply put, for business credit, you do need a business. Now, as simple as going to the bank, set up an LLC." Um, and re- registering it and then having money in your account. However, you need to build up history with your business because it's a new business. So off rip, start small, uh, add to your business account. If you can, put in a big, a big amount so you can see you have a, a, a big loan to like um, deposit ratio and then you should be good to go. But honestly speaking, bro, it's not a money podcast right now, okay? That's a little bit for Money Mondays. Cool. Um, that was good. I learned something. It's better than the ball wipes. <laughs> Well, you learned about the ball wipes, too. I did learn about that. Wipes. See, different types of value, all types of yeah, value. Doesn't Roman have, like, a dick, dick wipe to get you, like... I think that's to get hard. Yeah. I, I have never... you ever taken one of those? No, nah, never. Anybody? Have you ever Anybody taken something to get hard? I've taken Cialis before. Really? Yeah. You never the fuck up. <laughs> You've never taken that ever before? No, I don't need to. Bro, back in New York, everybody, shout out to everybody in New York. The royal honey at the deli. Oh, the, no, the honey? Oh, I've heard of I heard honey. it's crazy, bro. I never tried myself, but it's the same thing as I heard. I heard it's crazy for girls too. So it's 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 overrated for girls. So so my thing is like, if you're gonna use that on your girl, has to be like a special night. For example, like you go on a trip somewhere, you want to go crazy, but she might die. There's a specific pill for girls, or if you're having a threesome. That's yeah. That's why for threesome, yeah, yes. That's when you're nah. That's normal, bro. You ever take Molly before? This is haram, but no. Yeah, neither do I. Yeah, no, no, no. The most I do is weed, if anything, but that's what it. Uh, Diglett says 243k followers for, for that. Y'all down bad. I think she means, I think he means your page. Well, you're, um, we're down bad. Oh no. <laughs> Dude, I'm so sad. We got <laughs> Keem Chillin says balcony gang. Yes, balcony gang is in full effect. Actually, you guys know what balcony, balcony gang means? No. no. So oh, yeah, when you, fo- okay. <laughs> what does that mean? It means if you go on the balcony and close the door, you got to smash on the balcony. That's what that means. Outside of the balcony or yeah. in? Outside. Like inside of the balcony. Outside. So if you go outside right now, close the balcony. Wait, what do you mean inside of the balcony? <laughs> There's only outside on Yo, the balcony. Yo! What the fuck? <laughs> that, made that made no sense. <laughs> What's the, are we inside of the balcony right now? That made no Is sense. that just indoors? <laughs> what the Inside of this door <laughs> or outside Bruh. of that door? Bruh. That's just inside. Wait, do you have a sound for that? Huh? Do you have a sound for that? Yeah. I like making things more um, complicated. It's fun. I just said stupid. Oh, I can't. Bro, let, me read the, let me read the live chat. I want to see what they. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Okay. W Cholo Tate. Shut the fuck up. Uh, Haram. How do you get banned on Twitter? <laughs> I got banned on Twitter for challenging Lasanabi to a fight, and they said I was promoting violence. Free Sneeko. Free Sneeko. Hashtag Free Sneeko on Twitter. Let's get back. Tag Elon. Bitman X says, tell Sneeko to be humble. I <laughs> sent the $1 dollar. Fuck your $1 respectfully. <laughs> Drop your cash app right now. I'm sending you back that $1. I don't need your fucking stripper money. Mo, Persian girl with OnlyFans. Let me talk to your dad and let him see if they failed. Sheesh. Um, you wouldn't be saying that if I was paying your bills. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay. Wait, you pay your dad's bills? Yeah. Damn. Uh, First thing I did w- with my OnlyFans money was pay off my student loans. The second thing I did was give my parents money so they could live a better life. W. That's dope. I mean, I do everything for my parents. They left a whole ass country for me, so. Well, how haram is your OnlyFans? Mm. It's for you to find out. No. What's on there? Subscribe. There's a lot. What's on your your OnlyFans? You know, I've seen you before somewhere. You know, my dad actually got sent my leaked content. Somewhere. I've seen you before. I have no idea. Would you ever date a girl with an OnlyFans? I'm anonymous, and I stay off the grid. That's why I'm private. Uh, For now. It depends on what's on the OnlyFans. Why does that matter? Wait, so, hold on. <laughs> Serious question here. Sneeko, would you do OnlyFans if you don't have to like show your face? Would you do it? No. With your girl? No. Like, no, they don't know who you are, but you're just like smash your girl on camera. But like, they don't know it's you. Like, POV. Nobody will ever know. That, like, Never know. POV. Tattoos, nothing? Nothing. No. POV. 
And there's no consequences? None. No. Oh, yeah, of course. I think most guys would do that if they could. Or would you Or would you date a girl that used to have an OnlyFans and then have a family channel with her? And then deletes her OnlyFans? <laughs> if the family channel makes more, yeah. <laughs> and then gets some agency to remove all the content and all history of that yeah. from the internet. And we also, use the same agency that Chris Jenner used. And then you get Will Smith to fucking freeze all the guys, the Sims who jerked off to your OnlyFans. We erase your news from the their memory. Yeah. Then, yeah. Okay. <laughs> then we can start a family channel. You're painting a picture here. I see that. Darcy and Lopez says, Nico, I ask them to rate themselves one out of ten. Okay, first, can you rate each other? Okay, what do you rate her? And what do you rate her? How close are you guys? Pretty close. Pretty close. I mean, they're podcast hosts. They do a podcast together. Yeah, what would you rate so each other? What do you rate, what do you rate yourselves? I think Raquel's a ten. I think Arnold No, be honest, though. Don't cap. No, I think she's no, a ten. I think she's really a ten. Why is she a ten? Because I think, she's beautiful. I think Raquel's and beautiful. She had a fat, juicy ass. Ara does you do? Well. And her boobs are amazing and but, she told me the other day that she has that's a cap. wop that's cap. yeah i have a wop she has a super wop so. have you guys done threesomes before never no. would you yes sure no no that ass would you like right now on the balcony no <laughs> bro chill bro this is my date fresh <laughs> balcony game bro that's questions bro okay 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 um, oh, I like a man that gets that gets a little protective. Yeah, <laughs> there you go. Right. So fresh. Chill, bro. <laughs> says manscape sell those. Oh, I guess the ball wipes. Yeah. Are they called dude, dude wipes? I wasn't so. trying to give him free we promo, but shot. yeah. Oh, okay, okay. Shout out to uh whoever that is. Um guys. Okay, we got someone coming in right now. He should be here in a second. I don't know why he's taking so long. Who is it? You have a special guest for us? Yeah, I do. For the actual like live e-date. Because I'm gonna hop out of here and do my own thing. But also, smash the like button. We got 2K in here before the E8 even started. I think it's a good Facts. warm up, a good little. It's a good like little, little, little intro. Feel me? Like we get to know yeah. each other, get relaxed, get loose. I mean, it's all alcohol here, but it's all, it's all good. I've I'm... been on a lot of E dates with Fresh, and you guys are the least annoying of the two. Yeah, you chill. Good yeah, vibes. Yeah. I like yeah, you. Should we start acting super Miami and be like, "Oh my god, <laughs> no, like, no, I've had I'm enough. the best. I suck the best cock." Oh my god, do you know how many rappers' dicks I sucked in the past do 24 you know hours? That I was just with Drake like last weekend and he wanted to take me home and But he I took went... my friend's mom instead. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. She belongs to the streets. Okay. Moving on, Smiley. Sigo, what are you say, bro? <laughs> Send the asteroid. Send the asteroid now, bro. Send it now. Um I wish I knew which she belongs to the streets. You hear that one? No. <laughs> you, know, wait, wait, you didn't hear it? Hold on, one more time. She belongs to the streets. Yeah, I like that there one. You go. <laughs> okay, we got fresh that BBC says, big homie. Shorty just outreally says she likes dick. If I'm not clapping these cheeks by the end of the night, then you gotta feel my friend. Okay. Oh, uh, they're talking about you. He yeah, really talks like your dick for real. I don't know who that is, bro. It's you got to be lying. I, I usually, that. I thought it was you on your phone. No, I'm, I'm, it's not me. It is not me. <laughs> He's a paid actor. He's there every single day. So That'd be cringe. And then like, he'd he be lying, chat. You know that he said, oh my God, who's this? This guy's so weird. Oh my God. Now all these girls think I have a BBC. Oh God, cringe. Shut your ass. He loves that shit. Get the fuck. Oh my God, who's this? Stop it. Stop. No. Shut up. You know why it's weird? Shut up. Because on the podcast, right? Sometimes a girl next to me has a boyfriend. So it's like, bro, that's weird, bro. And then it's like, dog, being respectful, you feel me? As a man of God, I want to be respectful. Shut the fuck up. Corey, man of God, uh, for example, says, Free Stinkle, BBC Gang. Shout out to you. Chat, type a one if you think he's grifted. I was like, oh my God, I hate this. Type a one if he's like, you know, fresh secret. Why are you like, hating on me, bro? I'm not hating, just being honest. Like, type a one if you're like, come on. Bro. Wait, like, can we go to the very It's current, W Ridge, like, you know it is. Comments. Yeah, I got you. Uh, Anthony Moore says, Royal Honey transforms you into the Terminator. Oh, Apparently, the honey gives you the uh, power, power, power up. Tony Parker says bimbos. <laughs> okay. Yeah, woohoo! Rod Eric says, uh, freshman seal set for life and Jordans. Yes, we're doing a giveaway today, guys, on stream for the Jordans You're and the Bucks. You're giving away Jordans? Yeah, Well, yeah. what a perfect on-brand stream for me. I'm, I'm saying. obsessed with sneakers. Oh, yeah, you are, actually. Yeah. There you go. Wait, where's your shoes? You I got the Khaled's on the way. You're obsessed with something that's not me? Well, it's almost the same as you, like Sneeko, Sneaker. Oh, shit. W. Yo, yo, yo. W in the chat. She got some Riz. She got, it, she, got it. she got some Riz, bro. Some Riz. Big Mo. Fresh and Sneeko. Thank you guys again for helping the kids at church last Sunday. The kids missed you guys already. Thank you, brother. No, 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 really, no, 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 no. no. It's, it's not really about us. It's really about the children. It's exactly. Really yeah. Yeah. Be humble about it. They're yeah. the future. They are. Literally. Right, right, right. 
Next time you guys do that, I want to come. And actually, we're the, if we think about it, of course, we gave them a lot of money. We gave them all these turkeys. But really, yeah. we're the ones who benefited because of all the smiles that were on their face. And that brought us joy. So yeah. at the end of the day, we're the winners. All the cream on our faces, yeah. What the fuck? Donuts. Relax, bro. Chill oh, out. They're children. Do donuts. We want, remember, we wanted donuts, bro. Remember creamy donuts from Dunkin' Donuts? Okay, moving on. Uh, I mean, Daniel says that SOS episode was cringe from audience perspective. Proud how you didn't lose your cool. Instead, you made him look awkward. W Stico in the chat. Yeah, and I think he didn't realize it. I think when you get a little too drunk on a podcast, I also made that mistake with Big Ack. Like, this, it's just better to not be drunk on a podcast. I'm not sure if he was drunk, but just the, the whole energy was off. The whole yeah. energy was off. It, it's a good interview to study if you could see how to interview completely wrong. Striking it, Rich says, please be, please be humble, Sneeko. Every little help. Fuck you, two dollars. Send me your cash up. I'm sending your money right back now, bro. Leo, shout out to Adobo Tate. Shut the fuck up, bro. <laughs> Do you know what Adobo is? It's Filipino chicken. <laughs> so he's just taco Tate, cholo Tate, Wait, Adobo Tate, Adobo. Huh? You? Yeah, they use Adobo. Can you? Yeah, we made can it. Can you right. cook? L. Oh, you can't cook? I can. Uh oh. That's I a red flag. This is why she's my date. What can you cook? I cook fire ass lasagna. I make it two ways Italian or Spanish version. I can cook. What's the Spanish version of lasagna? So, Spanish version is a lot more like ch the way I make it. She puts some tequila raised. in it. They put, no. <laughs> the, you put a lot more meat. So, like normally in like an Italian lasagna, you would put like ricotta and like mm. all that stuff. Ricotta. So, instead, you don't do that. You just put like more marinara, more cheddar cheese. Like you use cheddar cheese as the ricotta, like as a substitute. Mm. Mm. So you love me, huh? I like oh, all the yeah. soundboard. Mike's world. Um, <laughs> Siko, why you let Adam pull up a pic of you in a corset that was foul? Shelter fresh. Damn. Of yeah, and he, he was trying to act like he, and the whole time he just kept saying, yo, you're a model. You're a model. Like, bro, like, you know what you're doing. Mm. You want to read you, Siko? Question for the Persian. How many carbons are in H2O? Get Tough Studios. Remember, you do um, engineer, right? <laughs> just fucking shut up <laughs> okay she can't answer it there you go there's zero <laughs> really zero there's i don't no know myself carbon molecules in h2 that's why i looked at the i gave, I gave him my answer you have to break it down like h, <laughs> Listen, h. leo he's googling right now actually Sickle's googling right now Whatever. shut the fuck up bro. <laughs> yo Racist. yo michael says sicko what do I do about Big Mo stealing my girl? You just gotta let it happen. <laughs> gotta Yo, let it happen. Big Mo, you're not, you're not gonna win that. Has anyone ever stole you from like your boyfriend? Like in the past? Like you did you dating a guy, he wasn't really doing his part. And someone said, you know what? I'm gonna take take you out. No, but you. there was a point where I was dating a guy and I felt like I wanted to flirt with other guys, so then I broke up with him. So then it wouldn't be cheating. Wait, 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 hold on. You're saying you broke up with him first before cheating? Hold on. Yeah. Wait, accountability? <laughs> Yeah, that's Yo, you're, you're three for three tonight. What the? All you got to do is delete your only face. Hey, watch your hand, man. Don't tell me what to do. <laughs> Bro, you want to fight, dog? On a balcony? What the? <laughs> I'm talking shit. Chucky says, girls, I want to see Myron. Yes, he will be here shortly. I just, I don't that's know. the special guest? Yeah, you didn't know? No. Oh, it's going to be trouble now. It's coming. It's on the way. Yo, by the way. My interview with uh, Cheyenne was hilarious, bro. You know, Silent TV? Oh my God, it was so good. You saw that, right? Yes. Yeah, I was, I was chilling. Wait, I've been waiting for it to come out so I can react to it. It's on not... Monday, it comes on Monday. Yeah. You I'm going to show you Riz, bro. Yeah, I react to stuff too. I'm going to show you W Riz in the chat. Um, did you did you get the Fresh of BBC? That is on Patreon. But actually, it's on Patreon, by the way. I put it on Patreon. You guys want to check Wait, it out. Wait, you have... Uh, you have an OnlyFans? No, 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 I do not. I'm just saying what happened <laughs> after the interview is on Patreon, okay? It what happened after the spicy. interview? Spicy. It might be a little bit like, you feel me? Um, Wait, are you hot. involved or is the other people getting involved with each other? I made her happy. I'll just say that. Oh. Okay. Raquel of OF Trash. That's huh? rude. It's okay. We're working on it. I'm teaching her. Actually, it's because I took a break because I don't want to do that. It's not for me anymore. I moved on and I make a lot more money doing what I do now. So that's the reason why my OnlyFans is trash is because I don't post. How do you okay. put away? And also, why did, why did the eclipse? It's no, no November. What are you doing? Rather than hiring chatters. Sorry, I didn't have to say this. Rather than hiring chatters, I like to 
literally communicate with you myself. So that's why I stopped doing it because I don't have just random people reaching out. To also, you. Okay. follow her new account, okay. Your Hairdresser, because that one's going to be the best it's one no, she no, ever no, remember, Stay strong. Stay strong. <laughs> that was going to be her best doing? one. What are you doing? Okay. Paying money for that? What are you doing? So bored. You're trying to up and build the best mobile app to help people find events near them. Message up for all the you on the panel. We can make millions. I think that's the app. Trying to build, build up a best mobile app to help people find the events near you. Uh, okay, it's kind of a rich chat promotion there. Yeah, reach out to them. They're reach out to them in their like emails, and maybe they'll do a promo for you. <laughs> there you go. That's simple. Uh, they got ones in the chat, bro. That's from a while ago. Yo, nigga, no, I don't, bro. That's weird. Sam, time the guy to uh, send the chat in for me. <laughs> Hell no, bro. That's awkward. No, fresh BBC, show your face. <laughs> yeah, show your face, bro. MK Ultra, Brandon Buckingham. This one is boxing match against Poseidon on KSI Misfits cards. Brandon called you out at the end. You gonna take the fight, Chico? I don't get my time to cloud chasers. Ooh, okay. Big boy talk. And then some last ones here. Fresh to BBC. Sickle, you're right, bro. He knows I'll be hooking him up on the podcast. Facts, you be risen up for fresh live nah, bro. every single day. I don't need any help, bro. I, I'm pretty good, pretty good by myself. My cologne, my swag, I'm good, bro. How much is he paying you? <laughs> Obviously, paying. <laughs> I don't know. Um, okay, guys. So we'll do some more here and then get into this. Um, start for life, Jordans. And then Stico, ask a question, and I'll take this away and get the actual giveaways. Ask a question if you don't mind. Yeah, who's going to win? Who's going to win? Oh, Myron's Arab BBC says, I'm off to the gym. I'll be up soon. <laughs> Arab BBC, so just ABC. Uh, Corey says, uh, thanks again, Fresh, for letting me know, borrow the Lambo before you went in and got the Aston. Stico paid my student loans too, like a G. You paid his loans? But really, man, I'm the one who benefited because of the smile on your face. So that's Aww. a guy. That's a guy, bro. That's awesome. That's, that, that's a guy. Yeah, but just seeing the smile on his face when I paid his loans. That was gay. That was what? Gay. Making people smile was gay? <laughs> you, how you said it? You said it so like, him smile. Well, the definition of the word gay means it's happy. happy. So. <laughs> Bobby F says, big shout out to Davina in Bangdan, Indonesia. Coming home soon, baby. Who's that? Love that. Yeah, for you. Aaron Chris Parkson. Yo, you know what's funny? No one knows his real name. Is it Aaron? Is it Chris? Who knows? Shout out to you, uh, Chris. I think that's your name. Thank you, Fresh and Stiko, for giving clarity, charity to the homeless kids in Uganda last month. That was in the chat. W's, man. Hey, we're, Shout we're, out to those Uganda we're, children. We're philanthropists. We're also uh, men of God. We're very humble. So W in the chat for us, man. And like the video as well. And they're single, ladies. They're, oh, or do no, you have I'm more? Taking, we're taking We're taking oh, right? Yeah. I'm taking What's going on, man? We're taking at least I thought so, but who knows? Um, Wicked Paradigm says, Fresh and Sneakle, thanks for showing me a bit of Miami lifestyle on my business trip. You guys are both real ones. Oh, Got you, brother. We took them to uh, Vendome and then Gold Rush. Oh, my Tonight, God. Yeah. It was Lit. hilarious. When was that? That was like two, three weeks ago. He had a great time. Lit. Especially in uh, <laughs> Gold Rush. Um, <laughs> I'm sure. W Sneakle, W Fresh, shout out to you guys in the chat. Um, guys, if you don't mind... Uh, Put your questions in now for when my room shows up, and then we'll start it. Let's try and check LSI tweet. LSI tweet. LSI tweet? You mean KSI? Thanks, Chico, for paying my mother's house. You're welcome, man. You didn't do that. That's a lie. Nope, I didn't. Joshua Arnold says, free my mask, Nico. Filipino gang, we up. Fresh your cancel for that cream comment. Yeah, that was that was wild. No, bros. Don't. Pino ask. boys in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's funny. Um, okay, guys. Uh, AL says, Fresh, thanks for doing... Okay, read these real quick. I'll be, I'll be right back. Let's take a Fresh, thanks for donating $100,000 to help Veterans Foundation. The people really appreciate your contribution. Real men of excellence here. See what I'm saying? Wow. Every single one of these shots. You guys are philanthropists. So can you give us one more tip that you give away in your podcast? We gave away tips on how to save money during the recession on the episode that's dropping tomorrow. Number Just one. we do to save money. Yeah, like number one thing that I... Suggest it to Raquel on saving money. <laughs> Don't tell. She's not going to tell. So, um, you have to watch it. Why are you acting like Adam is bad faith because of one bad interview while you know him personally fresh? That interview was not a good interview. It was mostly just trying to get viewers in because of my name. And it's a good example of how you need to really prepare about who you share your energy and your time with. And especially a time like this when you're, you're getting canceled like that. Chad, yeah, what the what did LSI say? Just like, just tell me so I don't have to go to Twitter. I'm banned on Twitter. I can't even do see. Do you it. want me to tell you? Yeah, sure. What do I search? LSI. Twenty from Scott Aragon. 
Shout out to the homie Sneeko and Chris. Sneeko been following and supporting for the longest. Glad you out of the dump of New York City. Thanks, man. I actually don't know what I'm searching on Twitter. So. Sneeko, do fresh and present. Okay, guys. So, I'm going to get in the way. Let's go. Fresh BBC. That's so cringe. So, <laughs> fresh goes screaming. So, Fuck you. Fuck you, bro. Think about this. Like the girth, ladies. So, ladies, last thoughts? Because I want to talk at the club. Who is going to win these? Who's going to win those sneakers? They're dope. I love the color. What's up, brothers? Can we see the girls doing twirl to see what they're working with? I just did one. <laughs> Listen, what I can you? read your mind. <laughs> okay. Ooh! Yeah. I can't that turn thing. Out I, no, no, Stay strong. I told you guys she's a 10. Question. What is the, law, the last goal you are all trying to achieve before the year ends? Before the year ends... 100K on Rumble, but I think I can get that tonight. Getting on ban on Twitter and continuing to add value and, and meeting a lot of my, the people that I look up to. There's a lot of things that are happening that I'm very excited for. And just shout out to Nick Fuentes, shout out to the Gorpers, shout out to the, the real ones. Uh, okay, so much light here, give me one sec. It's beautiful, what are you talking about? And what, what's the giveaway for these Jordans? How do you want them? Also, so there's a lot of you. You're going crazy on the super chats. Where am I rumble ran? What the fuck? Hey, Yo, thank you, Amin. I mean, W hijab, W Islam, W Iran. Just saying. Thank you, Amin. How do I get rich? OnlyFans. <laughs> or I guess Literally. have a Twitch channel, either Twitch or OnlyFans. Modern day love story at Twitch. E boy meets the OnlyFans girl. <laughs> and chat for people. This type of stuff is just like have been leeching off my name for a while and people who are like celebrated when I was deep platform. These are the pe type of people that you should not associate with. And you have to be really careful in this game about who you share your time with and who you Thanks. who you're around because there's a lot of snakes in this. King Rich TV. I'm from Ghana, but live in North Carolina sneaker right now. I'm trying to be an actor. What advice will you give? Please. My family don't support it. Been an Bro, an actor is the hardest career to get into nowadays. Everybody wants to be an actor. Yeah. I have a good moves. tip for you. Get on TikTok. No get on TikTok. Put yourself on TikTok. Start doing scripts on TikTok. That's yeah. the best way you can get That's yourself out there. there you go. That's good advice. Just make as many skits that you want and be creative as much as Recreate you can. Recreate really good scenes from other movies that you personally like. Yeah. Just make sure it's original. Don't copy from someone else. It's yeah, easy. I wouldn't even try to be an actor anymore. I would try to be an entertainer, and I would just get into social media. There's so yeah. many. There's so many people that are getting hired from being YouTubers and TikTokers yeah, for yeah. movies and stuff. Yeah, and I Twitch. know. A yeah, I know a lot of people myself that yeah. have done it. So, What's if, it? Bryce Hall got two Netflix movies recently for yeah. a big bag. If you're doing the act now on social media and you blow up, they may hit, hit you up first. So you never know. They will. Yeah. Sneeko was building one of the girls before Myron arrives. That's cheating. I'm sorry. I couldn't help it. We just have a connection and a bond that I don't want to can't throw that away. Shout out to Mr. Popo from DBZ Show, a pick fresh. Fuck you, bro. <laughs> Fuck you, bro. Is that Dragon Ball Z? So yeah, many. Dragon Z? Yeah, Mr. Popo's like a little black dude. Is he black or is he like oh, just dark? Uh, guys. Damn, the shit keeps going. I know. Wait. That's what she said. You can't go from the top? Nah. Oh, sure. It's fine. Just read it. Uh, the U.S. Secretary of Defense, Donald Rumsfeld, admitted the day before the attack that the Pentagon was missing $2.3 trillion. What the? Space. That's probably an America First Corp in there. Sneeko, thank Whoa. you for paying my light bill last month. Of course, man. <laughs> Look at all the philanthropy I'm doing, bro. Jeez. Yo, shout out to you, man. Bro. You, you... <laughs> Mo said, turn around for the Persian cakes. You're the Persian, right? Yeah. Yo, did she already turn around? Why you? No, Nigga, she's not Persian. She's Iranian. It's been conquered. It's been conquered already. We're trying to make it back into Persia. <laughs> that's just dead. Also, on Trump reinstated on Twitter today. That's w, great for free speech. W, I'm w, very w. happy about that, and I'm glad Elon Musk. Even though he folded with Alex Jones, I was a little bit upset at first. Yeah. But I, I understand why. I understand. Even Alex Jones said too that he understands that he has to play the centrist role to get the over the woke mob. If he if he starts to platform Alex Jones, yeah. he's going to alienate so many people. So he has to slowly red pill everybody. Elon is base. He just needs to pick his battles right now. I understand why, but it's great that Trump is back. But he, he wants to go on Truth Social as well. So so we'll see if he's just. Gonna plug truth on there. Okay, so ladies on the panel, I need to know what your type is and what you're about. Is that your personal question or is yes. that from the chat? For no, for me personally, I want to know what's your type. What do you like? What do you look for in a guy? And we'll start right here. Okay, I don't have a type because I don't like to say my type. Everyone has a type, a preference, then a preference. Okay, my preference is if I could pick, 
it would be a fuck boy that's <laughs> tall and skinny and normally when they're really tall hey. and skinny and lanky they have huge big dicks hey. so that's my type dresses well oh. <laughs> probably is gonna cheat on me Facts. and he literally is what else? He's already cheating. <clears throat> That's my type. But I go against all of those things because I know it's wrong for me. Okay. So, so you, you like a Pete Davidson? Yeah. What the fuck? But guys, by the way, real quick. <laughs> That's hilarious, by the way. Uh, Raquel. <laughs> um, guys, we're on, Twitch, we're on Twitch right now as well. Single actually pants. So I, I got to come off. So hop on YouTube, guys, and we'll be back uh, live on YouTube, okay? So here we go. Because, yeah, you're banned on Twitch, bro. I forgot about that. Anyhow, wait, what's um, that fuck up your shit? I'm banned on no. Twitch too. Oh, you are? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What'd you do? I don't know. I was just hot, I guess. <laughs> I didn't have like good mods. Hold on. Because okay, we're going to use mine. I just posted what you just said. But I'm not- so you're like a fuck boy that's tall and going to cheat on you. So why are you single now? I'm not single. Oh, you're not? No. Oh, shit. <laughs> I, I thought you were. My why are you here? No, no, no. Why not? I thought, I thought she was like mentally, but she means physically. What? What? I don't know. I just said. I don't, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> um. Okay. What about you? That one didn't land. Can we do the? <laughs> Whatever. Okay. And what's your type? Yeah. What's your type? Um, like looks or not looks. Dom Demarco W Sneego W Fresh. Buy the Creativity Kit. Facts. Thecreativitykit.com. Go support it, man. Anybody who's trying to get me to fight a cloud chaser, just go to thecreativitykit.com. Way more valuable use of your time. Okay, so my type is usually tall, dark, and uh, <laughs> some um, someone who has like goals and I have goals like businesses. I don't. I like people that are like what race? Dude, I obviously, I like all races. Preference wise, usually I go for black guys, but I'm switching it. I'm recently into Asians. Dang. We what um, Asian boys? We <laughs> no boy. way. We take Hold it over. On. Hold on, you will pick up him over me. Sneeko's ABC. No, no, I got. No. You're not in the date. You said. I am right now. No, you said you're. Listen, not. W Sneeko in the chat. No, 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 no. no. W Sneeko. Okay. Last time I'm in the date, who are you gonna choose? Asian or black? Wait, but the actual E date, you're not in it right now. No, I'm in it right now. No, you're not. Not coming. No, you're not. Until later, I'm in Don't it. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Who'd you choose? Black or Asian? Ooh, I want to know this. Who well, would what you about choose? black and Asian? Choose? At the same time? I am. I'm but not at the same time. I'm blazing. <laughs> what the, whoa, what the? Yo. Yo. Deja vu. <laughs> yo, don't make me bring up the fucking. Bro, bro, bro. Uh, Wait, you're black and you're Asian? Deja yeah, yeah, yeah. vu. Oh, that's Sheesh. perfect. Okay. Stigl's trying to like risk me here, but it's okay. I'll, I'll take it. Nah, for I'm, now. I'm a W man, so I'm not going to go bring up the past. Uh, you need a break? A mint? Like yeah, you do. Go get it and come back. Can you bring my water, please? It's a weird thing that I do. I, I have like, no, ew, God, get away from me. <laughs> I was just kidding, by the way. I don't want to. Uh, oh Max Man. Max <laughs> Man. No, hell no. Max Man. <laughs> she got a fatty, bro. I'm not going to lie. She got a fatty on her. Yeah. God damn. Shit is big. I told you she's a 10. Sneeko, thank you so much for paying my aunt's vet bill. They're doing a lot better. Big shout out to Rumble. Love you, brother. Rumble up. Rumble taking over. Yep. Guys, go support Cinco, man. All these fake YouTubers chasing clout. <laughs> yep. All of them are going to dissolve he's when the almost, real one's on Rumble. He's almost at 100K, guys. Go Let's support get 100K him. tonight. If you don't mind. Rumble.com slash Cinco. Everybody who wants me to fight, go subscribe to my Rumble. Go do it. Go do it. Um, well, a lot of these people pretend that they have beef with me when it's just like you. There's clearly something off with you. Clout you, chasing. Cloud chasing and like a lot of our obsessed make long ass documentaries investigating my life, really like obsessively tweeting about me, obsessively talking about me and my family. It's really disgusting shit. And it's just I don't have beef with you. There's a big reason. And there's so many of these people, so many. There's, there's one of a dozen of these people who are making documentaries about me, who have like even shaved their heads for me. And it's, it's weird how much people have invested their lives into what I talk about. So what you can do is join the giveaway. There you go. There you go. Ew. What the hell? What the fuck? Are you okay, man? No, my man. I was laughing and then it was about to go in my throat. <laughs> you, you like things in your throat? See, you guys are the dirty ones. <laughs> okay, Sneeko. Okay, Why do girls like talk about sex? No, that, I don't know, you brought it up first, though. It wasn't me. It was I you. said one thing about I like clean, nice, fresh balls. I mean, my name is Fresh, though. So. 
<laughs> Wait, you like Fresh's balls? Yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Hey, whoa, whoa. Woo! W Fresh, in the chat for me, bro. Anyhow, um, think we just want to see Ladies. Would you take a man seriously that is subscribed to 10 spicy pages and touches himself five times a day? Because that's what your subscribers do. No, obviously not. They're all going to, they would not date their subscribers. <laughs> like that's the big Wait, hold illusion on. of OnlyFans. Let's, let's ask them. Would you ever date a subscriber for your OnlyFans? Don't cap. She's we'll going to cap for more subscribers, but no. I have dated a subscriber before. No way. Yeah. What happened? Tell us the story. We need a juice. <laughs> we need a juice now. Tell us. Um, how did, we well, met in off, London. How did he meet you from the app? Um, how did it happen? Like did he from, like from, well, like he, he, I didn't meet from the app, but like we connected on the app, and then I added him on other social medias. Okay. And then we continued talking. What 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 did he say? Was it like yo, like I want to marry you, I want to take care of you? Like what did he say to make you say, you know what, I'll give him a chance? I don't know. He was just <laughs> he didn't say I want to marry you. <laughs> what did he say? What did he say? He was like, I don't know. He complimented me. He was nice. Like. He wants to take me out. But you get that all day from different guys. So why him? Yeah. He spent a lot of money. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> you okay. dated. There okay. you go. Okay. Okay. Were you attracted to him? Yeah. What well, okay. was attractive? He was, he's like my age. He's hot. I don't know. <laughs> Fresh, when's the first stream on Rumble? Monday, right? Monday's the first stream. Rumble takeover. Yep. Hop in there. Um, Cool. So, Cinco, any questions for you before Marin pulls up? For the panel. Trump is back on Twitter. It's W. Um, Love Trump. You like Trump? Yeah. That's awesome. I'm a super Trump supporter. Who you can vote for, uh, Miss Persian? I'm not allowed because I'm not a citizen. You're a felon? What? No. Okay. I'm Canadian. Gross. It's cool, eh? Eh? <laughs> it's, about, it's about time. Is, is that your couch over there? It is. <laughs> you want to go out and about after? It's about time. <laughs> okay, single, real quick. Let's say you take her on a date. Where are you going to take her? And what's the setup? So we've already bonded so much on this. It's basically like our third date just off this conversation. So I think we needed to go take a, a couple's trip to the Philippines. And we need to go island hopping. And then we need to go to five-star restaurants every single time. I'm going to spend my entire bank account on you. <laughs> and then I'm going to go into serious debt. And I'm just going to want to sniff you and then not even touch you. I love that. No, but I'll help you make more money by being the hot girl in your videos. Mm. So your bank account doesn't get low. Mutual benefit. That's our first day. Right? I like adding value. Okay, guys. So thanks for the stream. <laughs> we, can, we can turn this off now, right? That's, that's, it's a wrap. Okay. Uh, that was Simp Riz, but I understand that. Was I was what? doing your Dion. I'm just doing your Dion Riz. No, no, no. What no, does right. that mean? Don't it, worry about it. It means, like, for example, um, Simp Game. I think he's simping for you Aww, to get cute. you. I love What's that? a Simp? I'm dead serious. All of your subscribers. You know what Actually, good thing you're not on Twitch because you're not allowed to say that. Yeah, word you can't say that word on Twitch. But how you know? Oh yeah, you've been on stream before. I'm a Twitch streamer. No, but it's funny <laughs> because Sim, what did Myron say on the podcast? He said Sim stands for. I don't remember. What does it stand for? The, the acronym. Silly, impoverished, male, pervert. You know, it's funny. I forgot. I forgot, I forgot what he said too. So why are you telling Wait, me to I say it? it. <laughs> um, what does it mean again? I'm gonna Google it. Yeah, someone in the chat knows what, what it means. I just want to know what a simp is. Like, I don't need it's a the guy definition. That's, it's a guy that wants to ha- give a girl some like world. A sucker I don't like value. Mediocre pussy. Yeah, so this is this what it stands for. A it is different. Sucker. It's just a person. I don't mediocre pussy, in a nutshell. A sucker It's giving up with all your attention <laughs> yeah. for no value. So guys <laughs> who give you a bunch of money, guys who are just going to beg you to spend a bunch of time, five days, yeah. and he's not getting no pussy. So I'm actually a guy that you're not into that's giving you the world. Like a trick. Yeah, pretty much. Well, pretty much. They just made a new word for it. It's, no, this it's more like an internet design. thing. It's, like, been, it's been a while. I don't like a while. Like mostly internet. Yeah. I have been off the internet for like eight months. I'm back now. Ooh, ooh, hey, what made you come back? Hmm? Me. What made you come back? Her? Yeah. Why'd you go? Hold on, hold on. You were in social media world for a minute. Why'd you go? That's off? how we met. We actually met on a cruise. Yeah. On um, this like really lit like what was it called? Days of Summer cruise or something like that. Like that. But like, why'd you leave social media world? Um, it just bored me. I just felt like it was just a bunch of just nonsense and bull crap. And it literally bored me to like the end of extent of my life. Like I just didn't want to sign into it. I didn't want to post pictures of myself. I felt like it was just vain and just bullshit. And I didn't need to be a part of that. Did you make enough money from it to say, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just going to like. Yeah, I did. Okay. And that's why I left and I did what I wanted to do. Would you ever leave? 
social media world? No, I feel like I've been in the social media world since I was a little kid. Like, ooh, what is that? Dom, the Marco, Marco. The super chats are going yeah. crazy today in Fresh Stream. I want to see that same energy on Rumble because it's been quiet. Seagull USA men who, wait, Seagull USA men who are now boning hot snatch in South America and DR are counting on you to change American women and transform the world so we can come back to the USA. No pressure, of course. <laughs> we believe you. You are the modern day Malcolm X. That is the biggest compliment wow. I've ever received wow. in my life. Malcolm Yo, X is w my idol. Small Fidelity. Yo, that's him and his girl, by, by the way. That's him in South America, living it up away Sheesh. from all the Western women. W man's in the chat. That's hard. That's wow. hard. Aw. Cool. Well, wow. W Malcolm X. So Malcolm cute. X really inspired me, and he wanted me to convert to actually the nation of Islam back when I was a little kid. But I realized it might just be a prison cult, and Islam is the real answer. And I think that's what Malcolm X did once he went to Mecca. He converted to actually Islam. But this is this is great. He look at him and his wife. He's in South America in the DR. What does it cost? Like twenty dollars for some box and for some box in the DR. American women, and you need to yeah, transform okay. the world. You are you're putting a wow. Why why are you giving me this credit and not fresh or well, fresh and fit? Well, I think you have a young uh, take on it, and like your energy and power, bro, is like pretty good. Because think about it, you came into the scene re relatively like uh, recently, and you took over a huge audience because you gave value, and you said the truth. So I think that by itself means you're a leader and you're all right. And take gave you give it a close on as well. Well, Tristan and and uh, Andrew. So there yeah. you go. Also, yeah, subscribe to my Rumble. We have an interview with Tristan and Andrew coming up soon. I, I would think I want to go all the way to Dubai and do it in person, but if we have to do it online, then that's it too. But yeah, the, the reason that I'm going hard on, um, not going hard, but we're talking about how that interview with Adam was bad faith is because now it makes me look bad. Like, I, th I think he just didn't understand and he was cloud chasing a little bit, but seeing yeah. the response on TikTok for the fact that he was leaking information about Andrew, it makes me look bad by association. And that's what I don't fuck with because I really do value that relationship. And obviously, I really look up to Tristan and Andrew. By the way, um, guys, right now we're doing a giveaway and I'm going to have the girls pick the winner, actually. So Ooh, I hope I pick a good one. We're going to do three. We really need it. Yeah, we're going to do three, <laughs> three giveaways. One for the shoes. Right. Um, think, could you turn the light a little bit uh, that way? And then w one for a oh, book. Like no, uh, that way, that way. So we'll, we'll do t uh, two, one for uh, this book, one for this book, and then one as well for the actual uh, shoes. Or should we do one-on-one? -on -one? Like one person gets one, one, one shoe and then the other shoe? We can't wear it. And I'm fucking <laughs> around. Okay. Um, so we're going to pick a random How video. How do you make all, my, all these dad jokes with no kids? <laughs> <laughs> how, do, how do we know? Maybe um, he's a dad and we don't know. Not funny. Uh, okay, I do have a son though. Wait, Shut up. Don't, 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 you're going to do a bad joke. All right. <laughs> so I do have a son that I've been kind of keeping like quite about because I didn't want to put it on stream, but you said it, Nico. So you're, now you're exposing me. Like he exposed Andrew. That's Shut the up, fuck bro. up, bro. Okay, you want to see my son? Don't, don't, don't. He's going to. No, 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 well, I'm gonna go show her. Oh, it's so he's so cute. Thank this you. fucking so this Riz, bro, you fucking <laughs> fraud. So cute. He showed the dog. Where is it? It's so now nah, you can't see it. The dog is cute though. It's a Damn sheep, it. but I have a son too. It's my dog. You have a son too? Yeah. His name is Sushi. That's a dog. <laughs> okay, so. Oh. Why did you say? Why did you make that reaction? You don't like dogs. Oh. I'm by a huge supporter of Sneaker, but why don't you believe in manifestation? I do believe it. So, guys, overused. they are finally here. How are we doing? We're doing the giveaway for the what shoes. Up, oh, shit. God. <laughs> Damn it. Come it's over here, Rumble. man. Hey, Come over here. Up, up, he he said a word that you can only say on Rumble. What's up, guys? Yeah, I, they didn't pick that up on camera, did they? I, mean, I don't think the mic is good. Good, 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 good. It's like, yo, Myron's intro is like, what are F words? Yeah. Um, no. uh, and who we got here, man? Nobody. <laughs> Nobody. Okay, so it's Christina, they know who it is. So W Mary in the chat. Yeah, Myron's here, bro, because I'm about to do a giveaway. Okay, you're gonna do the giveaway. So, yeah. You still play? Listen. And make sure to like the video. We almost got 3K in here. He's had them Jordans forever, man. I know. I never, bro, never, what the hell? I took it off so I'm gonna move, move, move with it. What? We can't like it. Like this guy, man. What's up, guys? How are we doing? Like it? Huh? No, man. This this is very unprofessional. But how are you guys doing? Hi. Hey, how are I'm you? Laura. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. You're the like uh, Iranian. Yep. Uh, <laughs> nice to meet you. Nice Persian. You. Myron, pleasure. <laughs> Persian doesn't from? exist, bro. What's your ethnicity? Where do you think? Middle Eastern somewhere. You're close. Morocco. Where? No. Uh, Saudi Arabia. No. 
If it was Saudi Arabia, I w- we would have been beheaded you by now. But no. Uh, <laughs> now Not my funny. Fam- huh? Not funny. What was that? No. Continue. She didn't like your racist joke. Oh, well. Uh, too bad. I didn't like your racist jokes, given I'm what's going on in my country right now. Picture. That was a little bit insensitive. I mean, do you want to cry now or later? Um, it's not about crying. It's about making awareness. No, oh, okay. Anyway, haram. Uh, <laughs> yeah, now I'm from Sudan. We don't care what women think over here. Uh, so, <laughs> And nobody cares about Sudan. Yeah. What was that? Huh? This is true. No one does care about Sudan. That's why I don't like get mad when people make jokes. It is what it is. Anyways. Yeah. So is your feelings still hurt? No. Okay. They good. Never were. Good. Get out of them. <laughs> it's it's not it's the internet. Get out of your feelings. Which What's up? Been on the podcast before? Can you tell? No. No. <laughs> Have either of them been on? I told them to end it. We just spoke about it. Yo, his memory is so bad, bro. Which one? We just spoke about it. Who? Who? We just spoke about it. Two minutes. Yes. Ago. Yeah, but then I said no, they haven't. You did her hair? Yes. You did? Yeah. Oh, you're the one that fucked it up. Okay. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> She's the one that fucked up the hair. Yeah. What's wrong with the hair? Hair looks fine. <laughs> she looked like the Blair Witch for weeks. I was like, what the fuck is going on here? She had white tips. I was like, it was it Halloween? It was summertime. I was like, what the hell? Give me this it's all perspective. Yeah. It's his, just his opinion. Yeah, I mean, I was I was roasting her for I was roasting I was like roasting her for like looking like the Blair Witch Project. I was like, who did your hair? Well, it's not even Halloween. Like, what's going on? So, but so, it is what it is. So Stinko. Oh, I could tell. Yo, y'all been nice to them this whole time, huh? Yes. yes. Thanks for fucking. Bro, Byron pussies. came in here. He's gonna cancel yo, our dates. Yo, like, damn, bro. Gonna, yo, like, I'm coming I'm in here. I'm lying. I'm coming I'm, in. They're all like, oh, like, oh, yeah, it's all great. And then I make one joke. Oh, that's not funny. I was like, oh, they must. You guys must have been nice the whole time. We were sipping the whole you time. We were having good vibes. Yeah. Oh, oh, let me sip, chat. Oh, damn, man. Man. You got a castle all the time. Holy ladies, let me bring you out to reality. I got Can a we book save this shit for after hours? I like, got a book coming out. It's called Women Deserve Less. Yo, it's it's man. <laughs> oh man, book coming out soon. Um, he's so problematic. Uh, what? Right? I'm just being. I'm he's just like, making some jokes, man. Don't worry, but he's like toxic. I think he's like insecure. Like you guys were some, someone hurt clearly. him. You guys, I came in and I make one joke. Like, oh, my feelings. So I already know that you guys were kissing ass this whole time I was downstairs. I think someone hurt his feelings <laughs> in the past. My oh, like, man. Shout out to the chat, stuff. though. Shout out to you guys, man. Yeah, don't listen to him. <laughs> okay. I don't think everybody does. House. That's probably why he acts like that. Okay. So, what? Let's, I, let's do the giveaway. Act like what? Sorry. Sorry. Uh, no, you're saying I act like what? What are you? Did I offend you? Are you oh, your feelings? No, 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 oh, no, no. Oh, I, no. Not at all. I just wanted to know what you said specifically. That's all. Um something happened to you as a child and that's why you act this way yeah i was dropped on my head yes yes maybe times. other things happened to you i don't know but and, it, and it's a very sensitive subject that's so offensive yeah. so yes yes you so dropped in my head say, but i thought that was the whole branding of this podcast. hurt my fe- you hurt my feelings man hurt my feelings okay perfect <laughs> yay so who wants to win some fucking dope ass sneakers okay so we're gonna do the giveaway real quick um don't mind. Please. Please. Okay. So, and in the yeah, meantime, yeah. <laughs> so we mentioned that first. Dude, fresh keeps the shit hot as hell up here, man. What the hell, bro? Why is it so warm in here, man? You went to the gym, that's why. No, well, I mean, I showered and shit. Obviously, it came upstairs after. It's warm as hell in here, but it's fine. So, guys, if you commented on the last video, I'm gonna have the girls pick somebody randomly from the comments to win the shoes mm-hmm. and also as well the books. I don't they're, they're, they're a little bit fl- flustered right now, but it's okay. What? So you're flustered? Nobody's flustered. Okay, okay, okay. How do I put the, the screen up? Um, wait, what do these girls, what, what do y'all do? What, what do you ladies do? Well, you're a hairdresser. She's a hairdresser, yeah. And then what do you do? Are She's you my- I post my nudes on the internet for money, but I used to be a chemical engineer. Haram as hell, okay. <laughs> yeah, I love <laughs> the it. The panties Haram. really are coming, god damn. Hey, <laughs> my Islamic Republic of Iran is so corrupt that you don't even want to get into it, so yeah. Okay, so it's not Persia anymore now? No, it's Islamic Republic of Iran. Haven't you heard? Uh, well, okay. You kept 14,000 people are pressure. about to die for protesting. Did you hear? Really? Yeah. Oh, man. You should probably hear. Oh. If you're going to be acting like that, you should have some knowledge about the world around you. Yeah, so so, so, you show your butthole on the internet? Um, I don't know. That's for you to find out if I literally, show it or not. You quite literally just said that a second ago. I said ago. I take nudes. I didn't say I spread my ass cheeks open. But I might. I don't know. You, you can find out, though. Yeah, okay. Well, <laughs> I don't subscribe to OnlyFans, but that's that's fantastic. Anything else you do professionally besides that? Uh, I have a podcast called Off the Air TV. I have, you have a, a podcast? Yeah, yeah. They're both guests. They're both like hosts, these two. Female like podcasts hosts. are trash. What the hell? What do y'all talk about? <laughs> 
<laughs> what do y'all talk about? Everything. Like what? Wiping Spreading balls. buttholes? Wiping balls. About the recession, about what's going on in Iran, everything, anything. It's like a hair. Political. About hair, about why people should pay for their hair after they get a service done. People don't pay for their hair? I don't know. Apparently not. What the hell? I mean, you, you do people's hair for free and they don't pay? <laughs> no. Clearly, she's not the hairdresser here. Okay. No, I'm not. Okay, so y'all just talk about a bunch of random stuff. No, we talk about, actually, we the first episode, we just, like, introduced ourselves, so it was a bunch of random stuff. It was just kind of, like, <laughs> going back and forth, talking about our dating lives, talking about sex life, just having fun with it. It's a really fun episode and then the second episode we actually touch base on iran and everything that's happening right now because those are real current events that mm -hmm. are actually tragic that's happening mm -hmm. and then we went into a little bit of like recession talk and how we save money in particular so, so you guys are all over the place you guys are talking about out. geopolitics we're not really all over the place we're just doing everything we're just kind of seeing what every we're episode has a different topic so so it's yeah you guys are all over the place by yeah, definition yeah. you're all over the place yeah, yeah that works yeah, that's what i just said so when you're talking about geopolitics you're talking about having sex with dudes you're talking about your only fans you're talking about people not paying for hair so you guys are all over the place Cool. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Cool. This is why female <laughs> podcasts are trash. But anyway, uh, we keep going. <laughs> Wait, I have an actual question because that sounds misogynistic. But do you listen to any female podcasts? Yeah. Who? I don't. Which ones? She doesn't. But... I don't listen to. It's not. I like the ones that are a mix of men and female in it. No, but any female oriented podcast. I used to listen to Call Her Daddy. But you don't listen to extra trash. Actually, I do if I like her guests. But you don't. Now she interviews you don't guests. routinely listen to female podcasts. I do some of them if, they, if I like their guests. She's Captain. She don't listen to female podcasts. I do. Podcasts. I listen to F female she podcasts. Only watches YouTube. I literally I only know. watch YouTube yeah, and listen to podcasts. Like, so you don't listen to podcasts. Outside of Call Her Daddy, there's no real like good. Like I mean, that successful female podcast. There's Mean Girl Pod by Barstool. There's Sophia with an F, which is there's... run by men. Okay, but the Barstool. the host of the podcast is a female. Still run by men, though. That's fine. We, we didn't ask if a man or a female ran the I mean, company. They're, they're, we weren't but talking yeah, about the They're, they're running scenes. how they do their content. So, like, we were talking about the host. Okay. Well, the host. He didn't specify. And I don't know or care about who fucking owns their podcast. Who what? To be honest. I mean, that's, that's pretty important. Because they dictate the, the content. They dictate like what gets posted and what doesn't. Okay. That's which good to heavily know. influences the growth. And they invest into it, too. So, it does matter. Okay, you can hang out the video. You can do the giveaway. I think men and women are equal. <laughs> damn, y'all were kissing ass before I Come got on, here. God oh. damn. We're having a good vibe. Yeah, like, so we have some good vibes. I know you're saying it's a good vibe. If I ruined the vibe, like, this is what. We have to always be fresh and fit. You can't just relax and go to a restaurant. Like, bullshit a little bit. You know you're bullshit, and we both know. Like, I'm just being honest. Like, oh, my feelings. Like, what the hell? Sometimes be less honest. Maybe. Good girl podcast currently. Like, yo, we got, we got, but listen, we got listen. terrible hairdressers. We got people running around saying they're from uh, kingdoms that don't exist anymore. This is wild. <laughs> what the hell's been going on before I got here? <laughs> yo. Oh, man. Yeah, 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 man. We they were in a good, they were in a good mood before, though. Even though we were bullshitting a little bit, like we were chilling. She was coming in. We were talking about we're gonna go on vacation. Now she's all uptight. Look, look at her body language now. <laughs> like it's all she's like a stick now. Before we were chilling, we were about, what's her, you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Nah, she didn't sound like that before. <laughs> I mean, before I came on this podcast, I asked Fresh if it was gonna be like this, and he said no. So. No, I'm kind of chill, chill, chill. He said it was going to be a chill episode. That's the chill. only reason I've, I came on here. It is chill. I you know, didn't come here to get grilled. You've I don't, never I don't had care. your views challenged you cannot, ever. I don't give a it's very I, obvious. I do. Do you know my dad is a Muslim man? And do you do you think he was and cool about his daughter quitting her? Of engineering course he's not. Job? He's disappointed. Haram. So that's what I've dealt with my whole entire life. So I don't want to deal with it when I left home. Okay. I left but, home for a reason. So I don't want to deal with my dad. So you don't want to hear the truth. Okay. Still haram though. And you're super in your feelings. And this is a comedy for me. I mean, it's whatever, but. I mean, clearly you haven't had your views challenged in a very long time, and you're really offended right now. And this is this I'm is great I'm not offended. You are. Look what at you What are you right offending now. me about? Everything. <laughs> you are literally so tight right now. I'm not. This is giveaway. Can we go back to the giveaway? Can we read some super chats? This is comedy. Uh, okay. Bring up, bring God, up the uh, share screen, uh, Guys, I just want all the people that are watching. This is the power of not giving a fuck, gentlemen. 
All right? I'm telling y'all. Fucking up problem. the vibe? No, I, I'm telling you right now, Myra doesn't give two shits. I don't give a fuck, bro. Like, <laughs> Fresh is at least a W wingman, man. Myra yeah. come in here, shake up the room. <laughs> it's good content, chat yeah. loves it, but it's like, yeah. bro, you just follow what I'm a thousand because I've been right in here. I think this is boring. You you follow follow it. It. There you go. You can take your uh, yeah. thing real quick. I'm going to take get some water. All right. There you go. All right. Yo, W. Myron. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's an after hour Saturday edition, but just, you know, this is supposed to be a double date. <laughs> this is not a date. This is Frank Castle. This is not Fresh and Fit. Last time I checked, it says Fresh Print COTV. Listen, listen, listen. That's the homie, man. Um, okay, so we're going to do the giveaway right now, guys. So the last video I posted, which was, or which video I posted, is on a car reveal. Yeah, if you comment on that one. We're gonna pick someone randomly from that video to win the uh, prize. So we'll do three videos. We'll do one for the uh, Jordans on this one here. All right, so ladies, I'm gonna have you randomly pick someone in the comments and you just talk, pick, pick who you want, just scroll down and you pick somebody and the next video you'll pick somebody, okay? okay. So just uh, take the mouse here, Ara, and then scroll down someone that commented. But I have to say, um, hashtag Fresh Prince CEO. Jordans or set for life. So, so it says. So it has to have a hashtag. hashtag pressure, I can't yeah. really see, to be honest. Is it like? Is this the le- like? Hold on. So yeah, so like this one here is a, a good comment because it says hashtag pressure and CEO. Okay. This one I got here too it. as well. So I have to say that as one of the uh, markers. And then one sec here. Cool. Go ahead. So she'll do this one, and then you'll do the next one. So who's gonna win, guys? This one actually won one of the books, actually. So we'll do the book first. Jordan's will be last. So if it says the word Jordan, don't don't. Okay. You could do either or, uh, but set for life is gonna be for the book. So somebody in there that put set for life, you can choose. Can you oh put my. the Jeopardy song? On? <laughs> <laughs> I don't have that. All I have is okay. Can I choose this person? Quiet, quiet storm. Underscore storm. All right, quiet storm. You just won the um set for life book. One of them. So I'm gonna have you DM me, bro. And what I want you to do is actually I'm gonna um heart and reply and just say you won. Yeah, you won one set for life book. And what you should do, what, what, you know, what you can do is like send me the notification that I sent you this actual like reply. Screenshot this to him. Yeah. In the DM. I mean, he's a really good speller. I, I never type on a real keyboard. I have a MacBook. Just put, uh, <laughs> book one. The keys are not as high. Type book one before you yeah. click. Yeah, book one. And it's so hard to see with all these colors. No, no, it's just a lot going on right now. Good. Cool. Reply. All right, bro. So we got uh, one winner thanks to uh, Ara. Where's my phone? Myron, they want you back. Yeah, but yeah, they, 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 they want to fire back. They love you. They hate the stripper a whore. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, I'm okay? a only fan prostitute. W. W. W for that. Okay. So let me take a picture here. And then we'll do one more, uh, two more videos. All right. Next video is going to be the last one we did. So I can deal with this guy again. For the next challenge. Ready for round two? Bring on the box. She, she was so triggered. Bring on the ring girl. Yeah. yeah. She likes getting triggered though. It's working. Oh, this is comedy. oh god, this is hilarious. This is hilarious, guys. And she's she's balcony gang now, Myron. Balcony gang. We, we were vibing. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Like it was pretty good risk up until then. She was feeling me, right? You want you want to go help her out? Good. Am I one of them? This is your chance, man. Go go switch your G gang. The balcony balcony gang. Balcony gang. Yeah, go ahead. Go go. She's already shaking on the. Okay. There you go. Okay. Well, she belongs to the chat. <laughs> you can't look at me, that's Haram. <laughs> that's Haram. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, correct. Yo, here's the thing. You, you, you mess with the Haram girls, and then you go find the real wife somewhere else. That's what you do. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And she's so, stressed out smoking a cigarette. What is that? A joint or a cigarette? Oh, it's a joint. It's a joint. Okay, good, good. She gotta smoke something. She's that impressive. <laughs> okay. So, one sec, guys. Let me stop mm-hmm. screen. And then I'm gonna have you pick one of these comments here. Okay. And this is gonna be for the second book, uh, Set for Life. So just choose somebody, tell, tell me when to stop. And uh, we're doing it live right now. A window, sorry, Chrome tab. Here we go. Right, let's go. Ready? She just winked at me. She is kind of big mad, but she's coming back. <laughs> okay, so I need to. Has to say Fresh Prince CEO uh, hashtag in there. 
And either set for life or Jordans, it doesn't matter. One of them is fine. I like IMBD TV. I think it said TV or D T. Yeah, IMBD TV. IMBD TV? Yeah. Cool. All right, there you go. So we have a winner here as well. I'm going to heart it and then just say, uh, you won. Set for life book. There you go. And and Fresh one. does not play around when he games. Bro's eyes was locked to the screen. Facts. Love you, Fresh. There you go. There That's you go. I liked it. I like that comment. That okay, okay, comment. okay. Okay, book two. All right, now last week was going to be actually the uh, Jordans. You guys were waiting for this one for a minute. So. I, wanna... I mean, you can. You can right now. We'll do one more video. So I am BTV. And I'll ship them out, out to you either by FedEx or uh, UPS. Just depends on what's faster. So I got you guys with that uh, book set up. And the last one's going to be the actual Jordans itself. So let's see what we got here. Um, one sec. Cool. Stop screen. Sonny Ballin says, it was so cringe, Myron made it better. Bro, there's a difference between after hours and an e-date. Yeah, bro, this, this is chill, man. There's a difference between a date. Like, a date is, you know, is a level of bullshit when you talk. <laughs> Hey, I, I act the same on days. He does. He does. He, he does. Really, he acts the same way on days. He don't days. change, bro. He don't change. And have you ever been on a double date with Myron? This is just who he is. Yes. Have you ever been on a double date with Myron? You're like, bro, chill out. Yes. Yeah, I have. Can you tell the story? Tell the story, to, tell a story okay. of Myron. I'm gonna tell a story a about date. Mexican girls, right? Remember? Oh yeah. Go ahead. So we, so guys, a while back, we were doing hell of double dates, and what happened was, I met this girl from Mexico. She said, "Hey, I'm out here with a friend. Let's hang out." So I brought Myron as, you know, my W wingman. So we go, have a good vibe, whatever, we're chilling. And I think it was a cool day. Then we get to this sandwich spot, Los Angeles here in Brickle, and we're sitting down to eat some sandwiches. However, Myron made a joke about her appearance. And you know, Latinas, they all about their appearance. Now, Myron was obviously he's joking, right? Because obviously it's an American thing, you joke around, you have fun. But in their, in their culture, it's like, you, you talk about Oma's looks, you're like really hitting her in the gut. Cause remember, looks mean a lot over there. So Maya made a joke about her looks. I think about her hair. She got offended and just broke down, bro. As in, like she was like, "Oh, how could he say that?" Da 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 da. So Maya's very straightforward to the point. But hey, you know what? Simple can't handle it. Is what it is. No, nah, for everyone wondering if Myron just does that for after hours, no, no this real. is this is just Myron, twenty four seven. This is who he is. That's how they I are think, in the Middle East. I think men need to be more honest with women so they can start to live in reality a bit. You know what I mean? Yeah, no, uh, that's true. Too many it's girls are, thing. quite frankly, delusional, and that's that's a problem. That's, then they, you're right. You're right. Uh, well, it's, it's, it's tough. Uh, you guys should move a little bit over so I can do that. I, I got you. I got you. You got you. Good. 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 <laughs> what was that you said? All right. Yeah. You're a little large. So, guys, we're okay. going to do the last giveaway. Whose fault is it that you're large, though? Maybe she should listen in on Fridays to fit. Well, fit. I mean, yeah, it's, oh it's pretty it's pretty important. I mean, you know, you are in control of every morsel of food that goes in your mouth, but that's just me, right? So that is just me. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's just biology as well. You I know think what I mean? Okay, yeah. last video for the giveaway. My rank games for seven. I mean, LB store. The other one. Video down oh, below. I'm gonna choose. You look so awkward in Louis Vuitton. Bro, I don't. I don't. You know, there, bro. Yeah. Are you wearing the same shirt? Actually, no. That no. is. Uh, I'm wearing. I'm wearing the "Who Hurt You" shirt today. Yeah. Wow. Which is a typical. Perfect. Or actually, wow. no. Wow. Very on brand. Sorry, no. It's. I. But I feel like my bad. That's normally what girls say like, whenever I state a fact. Uh, real quick before we do the giveaway, the last one here for the Jordans. She's very observant. Um. I. I mean, I. Is just, that girl your girlfriend? Top. Is that girl my girlfriend? One of them. Don DeMarco <laughs> Myron. How many girlfriends do you have? <sighs> Slow to get Myron and Fresh are transforming the dating world of more than that. Myron is a genius and Fresh Mr. Cool with his gold chains. Love it. Great team. <laughs> Only one thing. <laughs> Very hard to manage a rotation without lying, even with money. My experience. Exactly. Tell me, bro. Sell them a dream, bro. They want to be wow, sold a dream. Sloan. Yeah, Sloan healthy. is killing it. That's the devil tip. Most of them can't handle the Don't truth. Y'all are seeing it right now. Oh my god! It's just like I hate this guy, bro. I don't care. <laughs> okay. Yo, okay. So, so wait. Let me get everybody's this straight. entitled to their opinions. Oh no, not again! I don't want. You, 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 I, don't, I don't know where this is going. Oh, I know where this is going. Jay. You know where this is going to the opinion argument. Yo. And then it's like, what's an opinion? Well, I live my opinion. I live a delusion. Well, there's a screen. Opinion, 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 opinion in fact. Yeah, yeah. There's an opinion difference. Oh, your your opinion could be wrong, essentially. You know, for could example, be. yeah. being on OnlyFans is haram. That's a fact. 
Yeah, it is. Being it's naked on, on the, the internet is is definitely haram. Yeah. And here's the thing: I'm not the best Muslim myself, but like, damn, like, there's just like some I things mean, I try not to. Before the violate. OnlyFans, I wasn't praying five times a day or fasting, I, mm. whether I lived in Iran or here. So well, I was you never, were super haram. I mean, I neither were my parents or my family. Not every single person in Iran is not haram. Everybody's in their home doing drugs, drinking alcohol, doing haram things. Yeah, but I would say like... <laughs> Just because you're Muslim doesn't mean you're going to be following every rule. Okay, whoever is Christian here? Who, when was the last time you went to church? I mean, we don't even uh, have to... You know? It's been a while. We, we, could, we could take it from the... Um, we don't even have to use Islam or Christianity. I mean, just, just... in general. People be, do, do Being naked on the internet in general, people are just going to judge you for it. It's just the world that we live in. I mean, I'm not knocking you for it. Make your money, People but, judge me no matter what in high school just because I had bigger boobs than the rest of the people. People are going to judge you no matter what in real life or I mean, on the it's internet. one thing to have big boobs. It's another thing to show them on the internet for money. <laughs> okay. Okay, what? I agree with you. It's not so. the same. I agree with you. So this is not an argument. Love yeah. you. Bye. There we go. Love you. Yeah. Bye. We, we all agree together, right? <laughs> okay. Yo, <laughs> yo, yo. I, I can already tell. Like, Did let you me guys do the giveaway already. We're like, doing it right now. Oh, yo, okay. go ahead, go ahead. Fresh, you told them. Oh, yo, <laughs> you could come on my shit. It's gonna be way safer. Don't yeah, worry about yeah. it. <laughs> it bring you? I, it's gonna be fine. And then, then you just brought me here randomly, like thinking. Well, she's yo, trolling. she's like, she was probably gonna be chill. She was. Oh, you. it's not fresh and fit. Oh, okay. All right, cool. I'll do it. Oh man, and you brought fresh. Look, look, oh look. lord, give him a chance. He's not a bad guy. He just I didn't say he was a bad guy. I'm honest. Yeah, he's honest. I'm just honest, bro. So, like, I think more guys need to be honest with women because women would, uh, how do I say this? They would behave better and operate better if they knew the truth. I also feel like more girls need to also Harsh. be honest with guys, too. Because I mean, women just thing. lie to each other and themselves and everybody else. Y'all don't... I mean, not everybody. I'm pretty blunt and straight up, so a lot of girls don't fuck with it. Oh, really? A what lot do you of people girls? don't fuck with it. Just... What, what do you tell girls that they get offended by? If they ask me if their outfit's ugly and I tell them straight up, like, yeah, where do you tell else. them if they're fat? I don't tell anybody they're fat. I don't. I don't fat shame people. So you don't. But you say you're not honest. <laughs> yeah. I don't. At all. I don't. I, somebody could think I'm fat. Like everybody's opinion of fat is different. I think when people are thicker, they look better. Personally, I mean, obesity is real. So it's like there is like that's not really. Okay, suitable. you said fat, not obese. <laughs> same thing, essentially. It's not. It's not, it's not the same thing. No. Obese and being fat, just literally no. the same thing. It's like fat and then obese. I mean, either they're <laughs> basically the same thing. Like obese is maybe a higher level, but both parties are still fat. What do you okay, think, Sneeko? You <laughs> You're quiet over there. Yeah, but 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 they are both. <laughs> I've heard fat. this conversation so many times. I'm just letting it go. I'm just saying, like she's the one saying I'm honest, and then I'm like, okay, do you tell your friends they're fat? No, I don't do that. I don't body shame. So by default, but you're if not my honest. friend asked me if she's fat or not, I would tell her, yo, yeah, or eat more. You're getting too skinny. I would tell her. But you, you said I, I was talking about my friend's outfit. I wasn't talking about their weight. You, you just brought up their, their you, you brought up their, their weight. But that, but that's what because that's, that's on brand for you. It's not about on brand. It's about being honest. You are the fit guy. It's well. It's not. A, <laughs> here's the thing. I, like when Fresh got fat, he didn't ask me for my opinion. I just told him, "Bro, you're fat," and he lost Max, the weight. Listen, Max, when I got fat true. after my freshman 15, my mom told me I got exactly. fat too. I didn't so, like it, but, but I took the opinion and I, I mean, worked that's, hard that's and I got hot mom. after. That's your mom, but I mean, like you're not honest with your friends, so you by default aren't honest because you don't tell them they're fat. So. Well, Just proves my point. Maybe that I don't, have, honest maybe with I don't each have fat friends to tell them they're fat. <laughs> what are you talking yeah, about? You literally just said a second ago, I don't fat shame. Okay, but maybe Martin, I, because you know I don't mean? have fat friends. You know that meme where it's like, bro, <laughs> yeah. you're scaring the hoes. <laughs> That's you. Yeah. Hey, man. That's you. Hey, man. Listen. The people are here. They want to watch. They're, they're watching the podcast. You niggas been boring. They don't give a fuck about y'all. Um, you know that dude who's hanging out and then he plays like death metal music while all the girls like trying to no! break it? Myron, you're like the actual version of that. Like you're playing death metal while hey, we, want to, we want to hear Bad Bunny right now. Hey, man. It's, yeah. I'm just being, all I'm doing is being honest with the ladies, man. That's Listen, it. we're going to do the giveaway, have an honest conversation, and then go get some food, okay? How about that? All right. So last one here, ladies. And you know what? I might call this one myself. So. Yeah, it's, I think you should do it. So. Um, yeah, you're the one giving them away. You should. I'm not going to lie, bro. You know what? Both of you guys decide this one. All right. So. Okay, let's let's share the screen. I think we're going to choose. Um, <laughs> He I did like, make I it more him. interesting. He did shake up the room in the stream. Like, I was going down this one. He did. Yeah, you guys are too nice. This comment here. D nice. <laughs> fresh always take care of the team. Keep winning fresh. Party brother. Fresh me steal Jordans. You know what? I think D nice wins it. What do you think? I think so too. Yeah. He and, even he, edited. and he also 
commented nine days ago. I think he gets like extra points for that. He is a one of the real supporter. People. You know what, bro? W in the chat. You want a Jordans, bro? And Yay. these are never never before worn Jordans, bro. That I got um, from an actual like reputable source. He's so never like, never worn Jordans. No, I, I those never, Jordans I have not. Oh. So, I got you, brother. Like where the Jordans? Cool. So now the giveaway is done. And guys, I'll do a giveaway like once a, once a, a month. I'll do a giveaway. So, shout out to y'all, man. Cool. Okay, Sneeko. <laughs> Sneeko. Sneeko, Sneeko, Sneeko. Are you still happy? Sneeko, Sneeko. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm great. This is a great date. <laughs> okay, we got to talk. We didn't even talk about my tattoos or star signs yet. I wanted to figure out. Oh, 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 my God. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, that's the star signs. No. So we'll start. No, 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 no. No. What's the star sign? Oh, my star sign. Yeah. Um, I'm an Aries. What does that mean? <laughs> Why did everyone go quiet after she said that? Like, where do you where do you go from there? Where do you go from there? Have you ever dated an Aries girl? Does it matter? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> What does that even mean, though? Like, Aries? What, does anything matter anymore? <laughs> Yo, by the way, guys, if you won the actual prizes, you can send me a DM to my Instagram, Fabric CEO, and do a screenshot of me actually responding to you with a uh, notification or um, just being on, on the page. And I got you guys with the giveaway. I'll ship it out to you maybe, maybe this week or next week. Um, but I got you guys for sure. And here we go. Cool. Okay, so you said Aries. What are you? Capricorn. Capricorn. What's what are you? We already. I already. What am I? You're a stag. Am I a stag? He said he's a bad. Or oh. you're a Scorpio. No. Keep going. Never mind. Can we bring mine back. That was better. <laughs> yeah, we should be bring mine back. No, no. Uh, Wait, what's yours? There you go. Ladies, here's the thing. Can I? Can you tell me yours? <laughs> Star signs are bullshit. It's not real. You you're living you in sound delusion. Like Andrew Tate for a second. <laughs> you don't live in reality. <laughs> Astrology is all made up. Men need to tell you the truth. Did you tell Elon that? Oh, shit. Did you tell Elon about the stars? What? Because if the stars are made up, then why is he trying to go to space? The star signs are made up. It's a oh. bunch of bullshit. Oh. <laughs> and no one knows. There's no, no, no one knows the exact 10, 10 that we were born. Nobody knows. You can only assume, like, what people tell you. Okay, tell but you. What, what is yours? Can you just tell me? I'm a virgin. <laughs> okay, I'm a Libra. I'm going to say I'm a Libra. Oh. Whatever, whatever I that means. I expecting that. I know. Because it's not real. Is it? It's not real. It doesn't matter. Um, cool. Okay. Sneeko, take us away. So we can get out of here. You know, there was a study that came out that said that people that believe in star signs are typically more narcissistic and lower IQ. Wow. It's people who don't have a lot to their personality. So we made up all these things like gender pronouns and your gender <laughs> neutral fucking, what's the word? Gender fluidity. Star signs, your Bunch personality trait, out. ENTP. There's a lot of ways to make yourself feel special and feel accomplished without doing anything. And that's everything that people obsess over and talk about nowadays. I just like to know people's signs to know if you're the same as my ex and if I should date you or not. <laughs> <laughs> Does that even work? Like, yeah. No, it like, okay, for example, I think personally, I control my destiny. So because of a sign doesn't mean I'm going to be that way. No. Nope. Some of the characteristics of the people from the same signs are always like similar. We're lost in this world. The West is lost. Anyhow, is e lost. Eden Morris. You got, you got it? Uh, Fresh and Seagull are fishing on the pond, all agreeable. Then here comes Myron with a <laughs> dynamic stick, throws it in and says, fuck your fish. <laughs> Dynamite stick. <laughs> Boom. No, we were having like a, a, a good conversation. We were, yeah, we were just both. We, that's a date conversation. Listen. Are you like, how honest are you on a date? Real talk. Isn't it just mostly just make each other feel good? Yeah, like, like vibe, vibes, chill out. Like, you know, there's, a, there's a difference, chat. I'm listening to pay attention to what she's saying. I want to know, I want to get to know her better, you know, um, tell her what she wants to hear. Uh, but yeah, yeah, lie to her. Yeah. Fuck that shit. <laughs> <laughs> fuck that shit. What do you do on a first date? Come back. <laughs> he Come just grill us. Fresh and fit, bro. He just does the Come same grill thing. us. Okay. Number one. He just talks about the wage gap. No, I don't care. What she said, I'm not going to go. I don't listen to what you <laughs> Mara's like, I'll, I'll listen to women. I'm not coming. Oh, the kitchen over there. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, I love making sandwiches for my husband. My husband is my king. You have a husband? You're married. You have one of those. Whenever I get one. <laughs> never. Wait, so that means you never, you never practice. 
She never practiced, bro. You got, you got to help her out. Okay. <laughs> Awkward silence. <clears throat> and let's end the stream. Okay, cool. Last thoughts on the show. Um, where can they find you? Your podcast, all that good stuff. All right, I'll go. Should take it away. www.raquel.com. Raquel Rose, I mean. No, it's just Raquel.com. Oh, wow. You got that? Wow. I love that for you. Okay. And that's it? <laughs> Thank you. Another one. <laughs> Off the Air TV is our podcast. I'm Ara Queen Bay. Okay. Roma.com slash Nico and the creativity kit.com. We have three calls a week learning how to make money online. And that's where I really go to shake up the room. A date is a different conversation, but you saw the good comparison between guys who lie to women and then guys who are completely honest all the time. And it, it's definitely necessary. It's definitely necessary, but there's a difference. There's a time and place in my opinion. Roma.com slash Nico. 99.1. Let's get to hundred K tonight. Let's go guys. Let's go. All right, guys. We're out of here, man. Peace and love. This was a W stream. Listen, my shoes are very short, one hour max. There's no pressure to fit after hours, but hope you do it. Yo, yo, pressure always wants to get out of here and shake his ass at the club, bro. The ending, ending after bro, hours L-man, at two hours. Oh, man, he just wants to go what? twerk in a rapper section. Nigga, I'm hungry. We had we had a good ass stream. Like when we had Salim on, we were just starting to warm up. And fresh like last thoughts. I'm like, we just got here, bro. The girls were there for five hours. Yeah, that's true, dude. You okay? So, guys, understand. <laughs> I'm a man of principle, but understanding. You can't have girls waiting for five hours and then make it seven hours, but you can't do that to girls, bro. Chat, type a one if he ends the show too, or if he ends too soon. Bro, bro, really? No, type a two if he doesn't. I just wanted to see a general consensus. This is your, this is your Dude, fan base. This is your followers. You can't have girls for seven hours at our studio <laughs> and they wanted to come back. You was it, was it about the women or did you just want to go network at the club and twerk? <laughs> Look at the ones, bro. I'm not you, bro. I'm not you. I don't see no twos. Anyhow, guys, I hope you enjoyed the stream. Oh, W in the chat for the winners of the uh, books and, and Jordans as well. And I'll see, I'll see you guys uh, on Monday or tomorrow for a stream about finance and fitness with one of my uh, mentors. So. And on another note, go to my page another for note. more of this. Oh, God. No, not November. Stay strong. This is Aram. Don't do what I just did. What did you just do? <laughs> Nothing. Wait, what? America first. Huh? Right, guys, and to leave this with a banger and on our Andrew Tate for that L stream earlier with Sneeko. Shout out to Mr. Producer.